Hi everyone, this is Katerina Christakos, and today we're going to be talking about how to add plugins to your site. For those of you who are not really sure of what a plugin is, it's just something that you add to your website, to your blog, in WordPress, that adds functionality. So it could be an SEO plugin, it could be something to um, add videos to your site, it could be something um, to add tags to each post. There's thousands of different things it could be. So this is how you get how you install them. You log into your um, WordPress site. Your that would put you in the dashboard, and then you scroll down and you click on plugins, and then you hit. Add, oops, you hit add new. Now, if you've bought a plugin from somebody else, they'll give you a zip file and you would just click upload. We're going to focus on some free ones. There's thousands of free ones. So, let's say you wanted to add a Google sitemap to your um, blog. You type in Google sitemap, search plugins, and you have a bunch of different ones to uh, to play with here. So this is the one I installed clearly, but if we were going to use this one, you'd hit install now. It would guide you through the process, and that would be it. Um, let me think of one that I actually want to install. Let's say video sitemap. Let's see if they have anything for that. Search plugins. Uh, video XML sitemap generator. I like that. Let's install it. Click install. It asks. You say OK. And then you would activate the plugin. And it's as simple as that. And let's see where they installed that. Uh, video sitemap. See? Right there. This plugin allows you to create a video sitemap for your videos hosted on YouTube, video, so any of the following that you would like to use. I always use YouTube. Let's save settings and generate video sitemap. And that's it. Also, look up here. Um, this is showing that four of my plugins are at, need to be updated. So you would just click there. I click here. Select all. There we go. Update plugins and it'll keep them up to date, which is very important for security reasons with your blog. And that's about it, folks. That's how you add a plugin. I hope that was helpful, and uh, I will talk to you again soon. Bye.